Oh, go to strip club. Um. Oh, oh my face is red. <laughs> <laughs> I am night driver. I spend most of my time driving crazy men everywhere. Yeah, they say they want to go for food, for good steak. If there happen to be some naked women doing some kind of ballet with their legs in the air, well, all right. They call their wives, you know. They're all like, I love you, kiss, kiss. And then they hang up and it's, where are the boobies? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. I want to grab their phones and I want to call their women and, and I want to tell them what's going on. But uh, I can't, you know? Rules. <laughs> I've never been to strip club. Well, once, sort of, in Poland. I mean, we didn't have strip clubs because of the communism, but they had these big parties where there's food and booze and sexy chicks, yeah? So one day, I take all my salary and I go. It's very nice. I'm married now. Oh, uh, congrats. <laughs> Um, where, where did, where did you come from in Poland? All over the place, and not just Poland, but mostly near the German border. Oh, I grew up in Berlin. Huh. You go on date? Uh, maybe. I, um, I'm not really sure. Uh, how much longer is this gonna take? Oh, two minutes. Well, I hope your date takes you somewhere nice. The men here, they're useless. They don't do anything. They don't fix anything. Uh, you don't even need them for the babies. You just go to the Mount Sinai, they stick a needle in your belly, boom, done. I don't think that that's really how... Men should be hunters, yes? They should hunt for food, and money, some things to fix. Tell you what, someone tonight, they offer you a drink, you say yes. I take most expensive drink in the place. He offers to take you somewhere, you say, okay, I want to go. I want to go Boston, uh, New York, uh, Paris. Not just some date around the corner. Uh. Um, it's not really a, a date, um... Okay. Say. You know, you women, you spend so much all the time on the makeup and the hair and the shoes. Oh my God, shoes. I have one, what you call, uh, uniform I wear. Black. I wear it to wedding, funeral, date, doesn't matter. I get my hair cut, six dollars. Boom. Done. You make them spend. You make them spend on you. Okay, okay, I know you, I know. Feminism, right, okay, back off. I know your type. My type? You want to contribute, you buy some groceries sometimes, yes? Yeah, just buy groceries, but then you make sure that you, you duplicate his credit cards. <laughs> hey, you hungry? You want some pierogies with onions? Oh, um, yeah, I love onions, thank you. There you go. You know what? You meet a man, say he's from Brazil, I tell you what you do, you say, I've never been to Brazil. And he'll say, okay, well then I take you. You could go anywhere in the world you want, a woman looked like you. But hey, don't you go to Sudan, okay? Okay. They sell you. They sell you for camels in Sudan. Did you say camels? Yeah, average woman gets, uh, you know, five camels. But you, oh, you could get seven, eight even. And make the goose face, the... The what? The duck, the ducky goose. Oh, the... Like this? There you go. Oh, nine camels and two goats. Easy. <laughs> Have you got something for your shoulders? Something for my shoulders, like a... Like, like a, a shawl, a scarf? No, no. Why? Oh, you might get cold if you stay, uh, you know, out late. <laughs> if you know, early morning. Yeah. You catch my drift? It's like a... It's a date, not date, so... It's a date, but it's not a date? What yeah. is he... Best friend beneficial? <laughs> Here's good luck to you with your benefits. Okay, so we're coming up to it, yes? Uh, yeah, it's just, just up here. Well, um, thanks for the ride. This has uh, been great. Pierogies. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I tell you what, okay? Here's my card, yeah? Oh, thanks. Call the top number, not the bottom number. Ask for me. I take you to Poland. Oh, oh, okay. Thank you, um, do, Dobro... Dobrogas. Do, Dobrogas. 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 Doesn't matter. You have a good night. Go. Oh. Hey. Hey. Hi. Hey. Oh, whew. sorry I'm late. It's, um... 
like a sin because yeah, I'm German, you know. So. Oh, being late? Um, yeah, got my Birkenstocks too. <laughs> hey, it's not yeah. a party without Birkenstocks. Do you mind if I put them on because I'm not so good with the heels? Oh, yeah, go for it. I want it to look nice. No, it's a, it's a good idea. I should have brought a next pair of shoes. <clears throat> <Yeah>. <clears throat> It's good to see you. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, it's uh, it's good to see you too. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> Water? Yeah. I, uh, <clears throat> I could use a little. I actually had a long walk over here. Oh. So it's okay. a little windy. And my skirt was a little. A little you know. Marilyn Monroe action. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's great. Thank Are you, you sure? Yeah. I just... All right, well, maybe a little bit more. And, ooh, nice finish. Thank you. Hmm. Hi, can I offer either of you wine tonight? Absolutely oh, no, thank you. I, I not... don't drink. I'll give you two minutes. Good thank idea. you. Thanks. Cheers. <laughs> Thirsty? <laughs> yeah. Is that a 12 year? <clears throat> oh, so uh, I went to this new Vietnamese restaurant the other day with my buddy Frank. H how was it? It was good. It was good. The entrance was a little weird. You kind of had to walk in through this corridor and then it kind of winds around to the dining room. I had a noodle dish. Really good. Is this what we're talking about? <laughs> noodle dishes? I, I don't know what's wrong with talking about noodles. Nothing, I just figured that we'd be. Brett? No, thank yes, you. Please. Really hungry. So, um,. What do you recommend? Oh, the um, the organic heirloom vegetables. They're like slow roasted with a, a, a poached quail egg. Really nice. <laughs> I thought paleo people were all about meat. Oh, no, no, there there are no no hard and fast rules except um, for the ones that are hard and fast. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. I um, I actually just found out that I have an intolerance to land animals. Mm, that's not a thing. It's a thing. Really? Yeah. Mm. Okay, kale moly, that is definitely taking it too far. I love kale moly. I don't know, I haven't bought into the whole kale culture thing. Have you had a massaged kale? You're just saying things no. that... No! You're giving massaged human characteristics no, so to nice. kale it's now. It's like massaged with some oil and stuff, and it goes down okay. a lot more smooth. Anything with oil is good. That's like saying you could deep fry this. You deep fry a Mars well, bar, yeah, you deep fry except, ice cream. No, except Everything's like a delicious deep fried deep Mars fry. bar is still garbage. It's not like a nutrient-dense food. The fact is that right. kale on its own is pretty gross. It makes your skin glow. It's yeah. good for your digestion. It's... I, I really... It just sounds... I don't know. Kind of hippy dippy to me. What? I'm, did you just call me hippy dippy? No, oh, no. I said the kale. The kale fad is hippy. The is fat. It's not a fad. I'm um, I'm gonna go to the bathroom and uh, wash up. Is everything okay under this? Yep. Do you want some help? No. No. Are you sure? Yes, Marco. I'm fine. Okay. I don't know about, you know, because you seem like you're sure. stuck there. Yeah, no, I, I don't really want anyone who doesn't like kale touching my dress. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't unhook it. That's what she said. Seriously? I mean, really, is that, I... I was just making a joke. This is so not a date. Julia, I was just kidding around. Julia! I'm no expert, but I don't think that's how that was supposed to go. Why are you here? <laughs> 